Spa-Francorchamps has been a staple of Formula 1 since the championship's inception in 1950. In fact, the circuit has been absent from the calendar in just six seasons during F1's entire history. Therefore, it's F1 royalty and symbolises so much of the sport's history. But there are concerns over its future on the calendar. That's because Spa's contract with F1 expires this year and it's not been extended. That means this weekend's Belgian Grand Prix could be the last race held at Spa for the foreseeable future. With Las Vegas confirmed for 2023, as well as a South African Grand Prix believed to be in the pipeline and the Chinese and Qatar Grand Prix set to return, Spa could lose its place. It's a decision that wouldn't go down well. Just like Monaco, Spa is a fixture on the F1 calendar and taking it away would lose the history and value of tradition from Formula 1. Of course, change is good, but with the move to more street circuits due to the money involved, as seen by the likes of Miami, Saudi Arabia and Las Vegas being added to the calendar, traditional racetracks are falling away, which isn't good. Taking away Spa would confirm F1's decision to choose money over tradition and history. The famous Eau Rouge section has been altered after safety concerns, but Spa remains a historic track, one that all the greats have raced around. Removing Spa would be disastrous. Street tracks can be great, but traditional circuits need to stay too, and Spa is as traditional as it gets. The most elevation change and the longest lap on the calendar, Spa is unique and provides challenges for the drivers. I love it, and so do the drivers. Furthermore, it's laid out with picturesque scenery surrounding it, and the weather is always unpredictable. Although, I'll admit, 2021 took it just a little bit too far. With news it might exit the calendar, drivers have been quick to state they want Spa to stay. Reigning world champion Max Verstappen has said, It will be a big shame to lose Spa. It's my favourite track in the world. I think it's just an amazing track in a Formula 1 car. While Lando Norris, whose mother is Belgian, believes Spa should always be there as long as Formula 1 exists. Not only the drivers, but those in charge of the teams want it to stay. Red Bull's Christian Horner said, Spa, for sure, it's one of those historic races. Monza, Silverstone, Spa, they're the big and historic ones. We should ring fence those and protect those. It's great that there's these new events coming in and there's interest, but you've got to have that history. It would be like having the ATP Tour without Wimbledon. Seb Vettel, who is retiring at the end of 2022, agrees it would be a shame to lose it, while 2009 world champion Jensen Button has admitted, if Spa isn't there, I'll be very upset. What do you think about Spa? Should it stay on the F1 calendar or do you believe that change is correct and it's time for a new track to be given a chance? Let me know in the comments section down below and we'll be back tomorrow with the latest runoff podcast ahead of the Belgian Grand Prix. Catch you then.